Hey guys, do you guys remember the time where I fought in KVK where I lost 10 million power just diving in, setting out my march to die? Do you remember that moment? I still remember it because it still sucks to lose uh, a lot of troops. Now, we lost some troops there. It's because all for migration, right? And during our migration time, we also had to reduce more power. There's a few things in here like this. Everyone in the top 300, kill 50k T5 now. We have two members left to enter, then we are done, and migration will be closed. But prior to that, there's also a request for killing more troops. So imagine this, I let my troops die in during the KVK, come back to Home Kingdom, still need troops to be dead, all right? So I was in this bracket, I actually killed off like 270k troops when I got back. Killed off some of my infantry T5. Killed off some of those excess T4 that I had. Um, here's the thing. This is the only first time that I made video about this. Okay? But I've already experienced this in three KVKs. I think this is my fourth KVK here in 1412. Since I came to 1412, we have done this. So this was definitely not something new that I've experienced. This is pretty much very new to majority community because never really made a video about it. And this is the reality of being in an Imperium Kingdom. I wasn't sure why I didn't really talk about it in the previous, you know, KV case. Um, maybe I felt like it's somewhat wrong that I didn't want to scare people off with the game. But at, at the point where I'm like right now, it's like it is very frustrating if we keep doing this in every KVK. Now, granted that there's a good about this, right? There's a good thing about this because I'm going to show you the good stuff that comes up, you know, comes out of this. In 1412, being an Imperium Kingdom, you do get a lot of gold chests. Okay, so that's a good part of it. The second good part about this is that with the migration by lowering the power, we're able to bring in more players in the kingdom, which is good for the health of the kingdom. Now, what's the bad part about this? If you're not a spender anymore, and um, like me, <laughs> I get frustrated about this every KVK. I'm going to be honest. I'm sorry if 1412 is watching this. I love every single one of you guys. You guys have been so amazing to me and so nice to me. I have no complaints in 1412 except for killing off troops. Majority of you guys can handle it. Like, I, like, the struggle for me is resources. I definitely have the speed ups because I get them from the gold chest. Like, even today, we've got serious amount of gold chests that we've accumulated. Like, I just collected 10 gold chests. The thing is, Resources is a struggle. Like, I do run two farms, but it's still hard. So, that's why I get a little bit bitter whenever we need to kill troops. Now, second of all, that I want to say into this one, or I don't know which part of the number we are now. One thing I want to say is that at the end of the day, I don't care about losing troops, right? I don't care about dropping power. You've seen me before, right? We have, you know, 20, uh, 20, 20 million dead so far. I mean, I have lower kill points because I've joined a lot of like bad reinforcement as well and bad rallies, and I haven't really initiated a lot of stuff in a very long time. Majority of my kill points are actually coming from back in 228 and maybe a little bit in 1382. But since then, I've dropped down my activity as well. I've dropped down my participation in some of the KVK. You know, for me, it's a lot more fun when I can rally. It's a lot more fun when I can defend. It's a lot more fun when I can do certain things, which I cannot do now because I am in an Imperium Kingdom, which there are so many whales, so many better, you know, so much better equipments than me. Better crystal tech. Crystal tech is definitely one thing that screwed me over with 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 the progress that I'm, you know, with I was doing rallies and especially the equipments and stuff. Back then it was much easier, much nicer. All right, I'm getting into my rant. Um, basically, those are some of the things that I experienced in, in an Imperium Kingdom. Now, I'm not saying I'm migrating out. I'm not saying this. I'm just saying there's some frustrations that I have. Now, I do like it in 1412. I love it, it being in here because everybody is, you know, generally nice to me. The only time they did is this time they messaged me, hey, we need you to drop power. Now, granted, I didn't do a lot of participation in the last KVK. That's okay. I was busy. You guys saw the LA trip as well. So... Oh, one more thing. Next KVK, I already told the boot, I might not be active. I might not be fighting a lot, but I'll be there. I might not be able to record. Basically, that's the biggest thing. 
because I will be going to my home country for a month and visiting and eating some coconuts and green mango. And I miss it. And I'm going to meet some people um, that are playing Rise of Kingdoms as well. But here's the biggest thing about this content, okay? I'm being sidetracked right now. What the heck? The biggest thing about this content is that we've dropped the power. A lot of people dropped the power. I dropped the power. Puddle Cakes dropped power. Many 1412 dropped the power. To welcome some of the new players here in 1412. And um, our old farm accounts are now a new main account. Main um, main farms, I think. Main, main uh, whatever. Uh, main accounts now. This is the farm before. Now it's a 7 billion power alliance. Now we have... Uh, we lost 1412 exclamation. I think 1412 exclamation is now KNT. So this is the KNT. We've talked about them before. We had one of their guys here talked in our channel. All right. Guys, welcome. Bo and Lisa QA, their leader. We were with them in the KVK and now they are here in our kingdom. So they are, um, you know, 11 billion alliance. A whole alliance migrated here. Isn't that amazing? I mean, it just looks like the same from when I looked at their alliance before. Now, we got Bo, Asa, not Elisa, Asa, sorry, Q8. They're from Kuwait. Um, anyway, I'm just going to call him Bo because before I butchered the name, Bo. I've talked to Bo, very nice guy. I love it. I'm very excited for what's next in 1412. By having a third big alliance is definitely a big impact to our gaming, into our success. Now, granted, we lost our last KVK. Positioning was terrible. Matchup was just bad. Full loss. I mean, I've been in 14-12. We've lost before. Baba was here before. We've lost with Baba as well. That's acceptable. Rise of Kingdoms gaming, there's always wins, there's always loss. I've won with 14-12, I've lost in 14-12, I've won in 12, you know, 2 2 8 I've lost in 2-2-8, won in 1382, lost in 1382. It's part of the game. And many people also try to say things that I hop around like, you know, a lot of content creators do this, hop around. If you guys actually realize that Shinchi 42 do not hop around kingdoms to kingdoms, I try to stay as long as I can in a kingdom until I find something that you know, I need to migrate. Um, so I'm staying in 1412 because I never found that, you know, big reasons for me to to leave and, you know, abandon. Uh, I know there are players who migrated into uh, 1412 because I'm here. So that's one of the biggest things as well that I just don't like to uh, waste people's money and, you know, playing with us here in 1412 as well. And the same thing with 2500. I know there are players who migrated in 2500 uh, because I'm there. And that's one of the reasons why, you know, I've been invited to migrate out. I can't, I can't do it, you know. It's, it's like my little connection with you guys, all right. So anyway, um, KNT, brand new alliance in 1412. I think they're going to be a big addition. I don't think I can read off everybody's name, but you guys can just look at this. You know, if you're here and you're watching I, from KNT, I want us to say thank you guys for, you know, coming to 1412. I hope we will have a wonderful KVK. I mean, I might not be in the next one. I might not be so active on the next one, but onto the next next one, I will definitely be there. If everything is still going well in 1412, then we can definitely have a lot of fun. So these are some of the guys who have migrated. Um, maybe some of them are, ooh, NFT guy, board ape, okay. Ooh, a hentai guy. Um, oh, okay, trap, I'm just kidding. Um, so, you know, welcome here. You know, I don't know who are some of the 1412 original that, that stayed here or all of you guys are new, but I feel like you guys are all new. So welcome. There's a lot of powerful player, 100 million player in here, which is really good. Like this one, you know, good kill points. I think these guys are definitely a great addition to 1412. All right. So let's take a look at, you know, some of their, you know, leadership in here. Right? Look at the stats. Um, look at the stats in here. Let's see. Lion Sully. Right? Aziz. We got two Aziz now. All right? So don't get confused. All right? There we go. Great kills. Zoro. Ooh, huge kills. Reina. Isn't this from... What cartoon character is this from? What cartoon character is this? Um, what is this? Let's check her out real quick in here. Mmm. Okay. Um, last day like T4 player. Where is she? Where is this? Rome Coliseum? You always have serious problem with resources. 
this is uh betty boobs or what is that what is that thing all right it looked like a betty boobs but i don't think it is maybe this is a representation of herself and um, i will i will step out of that picture now before i say something else that um, i probably shouldn't shouldn't say or shouldn't think about okay so let's move on and um gaga cayenne um uh, carol this is uh what is this uh, i've never seen it suicide squad or whatever that is that um villain movie thingy um yeah i mean um you know i'm just excited to have everybody in here great you know that you guys have finally migrated i know it costs a lot of money as well to migrate i know it's not cheap but thank you guys for being here we also want to welcome the hk as well 12 hk um based on what lil told me they have about 50 members to the migration was not complete they have about 50 members who have migrated into um 1412 so welcome i'm not sure what happened but i'm glad that you guys are here these guys are i think yeah these guys are japanese so that's great. I mean, they're probably not going to understand the video that we're going to make. If you can speak English and you're watching this video, help it translate to uh, to uh, to your friends. Actually, I'll try to put some subtitle if I can. But we've got some new Japanese players now here in 1412. 1412 is not going to be mainly Arabic anymore. It's definitely an international kingdom. So maybe next time you're interested in migrating to 1412, maybe reach out to our leadership, like Lil Dracania, or I call her Drac, she loves it when you call her Drac. Don't call her Lil. She does not like to be called Lil. This one, no, X Drac. Drac is the only way you can talk to her. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, rockers, guys, I think I'm very excited for the next KVK. I think 1412 has a bright future, and this is going to be really, really good. Uh, one thing that I want to say with 1412, I think... We have a good reputation between many, many kingdoms. I mean, I've seen a lot on Facebook about certain kingdoms that are getting publicity but bad reputation. But I think 1412 has good publicity and good reputation. Anyway, rockers, thank you guys for watching this. I'll see you again next time. And welcome, new migrants.